Hey guys, it's Goosebumps Completionist, and I'm bringing you another haul video today. I scored pretty good at this one particular used bookstore. If you have them in your area, you need to go check them out. The store is called Second and Charles. It is owned by the same company that runs Books a Million. And Second and Charles is a little bit different than Books a Million, as Books a Million is pretty much all brand new merchandise, and Second and Charles is a mixture of new merchandise and used merchandise. They buy in and then resell uh, from their communities. So it just so happened that a big portion of this haul I got from uh, a big sale and I pretty much spent after tax $17 for I think like 20 something books and then I got a couple from the free bin that they have outside and I'll tell you about that in a sec and then I was gifted one of those goosebump collector tins from uh, my sister for Christmas. So, anywho, let's get to the free bins first because these are doubles as you'll see or have seen in past videos. I like to uh, check these free bins every time I'm at Second and Charles just because you never know what you'll find in their uh, last haul video, I think, is when I showed you that free uh, How I Got My Shrunken Head book. It was from that uh, same store. And this time, I happen to be in the area, and we go near the free bin, and sure enough, my girlfriend points out, hey, look, these books are in there, and I found six of them. And it just so happens that all six books I already have, but they're good reader copies to have in the collection, so I don't have to open up my nicer copies. I can just read these anytime I feel like I want to read them. So, books I have gotten in the past. I found another copy. This one's missing the cards, but it's still a good reader copy. Egg Monsters from Mars. So that was cool to find. Uh, this one just so happens to be the same type of edition I already have, but another copy of Beware the Snowman for reading. That's cool. Uh, I have this edition in one of those um, packs I got from Ollie's, so not of the Living Dummy 1. Great book to have a reader of. Got that? These are all free, mind you. I found these in the free bins outside. Normally, they put people come by and will donate books that um, maybe the store wouldn't take in, or some people just drive from the area and just drop off free stuff in there. I've gotten like really good video games in there for free in the past. It kind of hurt to check, and it's different every day. You never know what you'll find in there. But um, found this one too Curse of the Mummy's Tomb. Beat up, but free. And then these two, I actually got in the uh, buy five, give five deal. Um, so I went ahead and found readers anyway, as you'll see later in the video. Monster Blood 2. Has some writing on the cover. But yeah, free. Just chilling in there. And then here comes the Shaggity. And this one's actually a pretty nice copy. And I got it as a reader, so. Yeah, it can't hurt. So. Six free Goosebumps books, I'll take it. Now I'll show you the collector's tin that was gifted to me for Christmas. I got the purple tin. I was surprised to get this. Uh, comes with Monster Blood, Why I'm Afraid of Bees, A Night in Terror Tower, The Bees from the East, and Legend of the Lost Legend. And it comes with this cool collector's tin. You have Why I'm Afraid of Bees, Bees from the East, and Night in Terror Tower on there. So I got one of them finally. Uh, now I just need the other ones to complete my 10 collection and I got them all but anyway let's get into this first mini stack which I'll go ahead and flash you here these were buy five give five so let's count the spines we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven well, I'll set this one aside so five of these I bought and five of these were free. The average price for each book ended up being like a dollar twenty-five, a dollar fifty range. So yeah, let's get into these. Which books did I pick up? So first one. I got me a first edition How I Learned to Fly. Great book. Great book to have. Um so yeah. It doesn't matter really which ones you think uh which ones I bought or whatnot. I got five of them free. 
uh, five of them I purchased, so it doesn't really matter. Phantom of the Auditorium, first edition. This one, I was happy to find. I've been looking, eyeballing this one online, trying to get a copy. Found one. Uh, Series 2000 book, what is this? 21, The Haunted Car. First edition. Oh, is it first edition? No, this is the second edition. Ghost Next Door. Second edition. Uh, I got a Fear Street book. It's kind of out, out of the... It's the only Fear Street book I have. But uh, I think this is book seven. Fright Night. Awesome. I'm probably going to review that. I'm going to try to get some more Fear Street books. It's just, I just never find them for some reason. So, yeah. Um, so I'll try to read that soon. Sooner than later. All right, this book is a vanishing collection, and it collects Curse of the Mummy's Tomb, Let's Get Invisible, and Say Cheese and Die. Still has like a five below sticker on it. Yeah, and the buy five get five. Nice. This one is a first edition, Revenge of the Lawn Gnomes. Awesome book. I this was one of my favorite ones growing up. I can't wait to reread this. I'm gonna have to. I have so many books backed up right now. Um, I'm going to have to get to them. But yeah, we'll, can't wait to read that one. And here's some newer ones. Like I said, this was already part of the Buy 5, Get 5. Uh, Goosebumps Most Wanted. Here Comes the Shaggy. So I got this copy and a reader. So that's nice. Uh, Frankenstein's Dog. I think Michael Goosebumps fan said he really enjoyed this book. So... Yeah, I'm gonna try to get a cop. I'm gonna try to get this one done soon. I want to see what this one's all about. And this one, <laughs> I've heard so many good things about Hall of Horrors, and I was excited to see a used copy in this condition in there. Looks pretty much brand new. Um, not at the giant everything. Can't wait to read that one. Uh, Hall of Horrors, to me, is the equivalent of like Series 2000 of Modern Goosebumps from what I've read so far. Uh, really enjoy that. So let's see, we got another stack. And it's all it all depends on what time you go. So five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So I had a little remainder. So basically I got I paid for 13 of them and I got 10 free. If I did my math right. So here's another stack. Alright, so five of these were free, five of them were bought. And like I said, I paid like a total of like $17, something like that, um, for all of them. So, got a really good deal. Chicken Chicken. Beat up copy, but I, I didn't own this one, so glad to have that. Deep Trouble. This one's a first, no, this one's a second edition, but Deep Trouble. Not too bad. Here's a first edition, Bad Hair Day. I guess somebody had a Goosebumps lot sitting around and I just happened to come across them. Um, that's the only way I can explain how I found this many. Normally when I go, I'm, I might be get lucky to find like three or four books. I got really lucky here. Night of the Living Dummy 3. This one's kind of a reader copy. I don't own it yet though. Uh, I need to upgrade it. But first edition, Night of the Living Dummy 3. Awesome. Um, here we go, one of those reissues. Monster Blood. We got, let's see here, Monster Blood 2. This one's a nice copy. Yeah, so this one would be my keeper, but yeah. In Monster Blood 3. <laughs> So yeah, I got Monster Blood one through three. Now I can do a little binge. I just don't have I don't have four. That's the one I'm missing. Um, but yeah. And then I was happy to find four Give Yourself Goosebumps books. Uh, unfortunately, they're not any any of the rarer ones. But uh, I've been wanting some of these, so happy to get them. Uh, Deadly Experiments of Doctor E. Now the condition on these are pretty good for for the most part. Um, this one kind of has a little spine damage on the back, but yeah, I'll take that. 
Um, let's see here. Oh yeah, Night in Werewolf Woods. Love this book. Love werewolves and goosebumps. I cannot wait to read this and review this on this channel. This is really high up there. Once I get through these next three books, I've been uh, having high on my list. This one's right underneath it. Right underneath it. So stay tuned for that one. And it'll honestly depend on which ones I finish first. I probably might review it before some other ones I've been wanting to read. It just depends. Um, beware of the purple peanut butter. Sorry about the glare. I know uh, Zilu, if you're out there watching, that's one of your books you like. So I'll try to read that one too. It's been a long time since I, I think I've read it in the past. I just don't remember it. And this one I have not read before, but it kind of, it, it's, it's piquing my interest. Um, Under the Magician's Spell. Awesome. So, yeah. Buy five, get five. Ten of those were free. And then I had a remainder of three. And these are the last three books, I guess. Um, first edition, Piano Lessons Can Be Murder. I don't know. Mixed, mixed reviews about that book. Some people love it and hate it at the same time. I don't know. But yeah. This one was probably the best condition one out of all of them. Um, super happy to get it. Uh, the Blob That Ate Everyone. It's kind of bummed. No Ghost Camp, no uh, Curse of Camp Cold Lake or anything, but, you know, I'll take it. I'll take it. You know, why not? And then this one was really cool to find. I guess this one was one of my favorite uh, books I found, and I've already read this one, and I'm about to do a review right after this video. Um, Triple Header, book two. Now, this cover is actually a Tim Jacobus cover. I almost broke down one time on eBay and paid $10 for this, so I'm glad I waited and got this for a really good deal. So yeah, uh, two giant stacks of goosebumps. Let me let me reiterate this. All of these, and all of these, were like seventeen bucks. Couldn't believe it. This little stack here was outside in the free bins, and this was a Christmas gift. So yeah, that was my goosebumps haul. Um, if anybody else has picked up anything Goosebumps recently, let me know. I'm curious to see what you guys are picking up and finding out there. And stay tuned. I got another video right after this. And see ya.